In this tutorial, we're going to discuss about a gumball modeling aid. It's one of the options in Rhino that uh, saves you a lot of time when you're modeling. You can actually turn it on by going to the options. And then uh, there is this option here that says modeling aids. And then there is this gumball option there. And you would want to have it enabled. So what it does is it's actually enabled here from this option. So if you have this turned off, you will not see it. If you turn it on, it will appear. The nice thing about this option is that you can actually uh, use it to ma manipulate existing geometry fairly quickly. So, for example, here I can just use the the blue arrow, uh, click on it, and type 20. And I will see that my object will move 20 units up. I can also use minus 20 to, to get it back where it was. Then what, what I can do, I can actually use these handles for scaling. So I can just scale it type 10 enter to scale for 10 uh, uh, I can actually hold shift and use this red one to uniformly scale it into a D like this you can use any of these handles to, to scale it up and down uh, depending on what you want you can actually also rotate it you can actually say okay I want this rotated for 30 degrees and just type 30 press enter and there it is uh, I find this very useful and I would recommend for everybody who has the, any kind of modeling uh, to do in Rhino, definitely recommend using this option. Uh, another one, another thing I didn't say is that you can actually use this plane here to move it on X and Y uh, a plane or uh, you can use it, you, uh, move it here on uh, Z and X plane like this.